I'm gonna hate myself after filming this video because my room is so clean right now, but there's just about to be boxes literally Welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope you've been doing well. I'm pretty sure the last video you guys saw was very interesting, very funny. At least I hope you thought it was funny. Um, I had so much fun filming that video with my little brother. But today I have a bunch of boxes in front of me. Um, we're not doing any makeup, we're not doing anything like that. Um, I kind of want to do an unboxing. I've been collecting a lot of products, a lot of boxes, a lot of things I've been ordering within the past couple of weeks maybe like two months max two and a half months um, and I'm like you know what why don't I do an unboxing I don't know if that's something interesting that people like to watch I don't mind watching unboxings so I'm gonna try it out if y'all don't like it if it doesn't do well I won't do it again but you know it's worth a shot at least I tried so I hope you guys enjoy it and let's go ahead and get started so I kind of want to start from little to biggest Actually, I take that back. I'm gonna just open what's in front of me. Um, so I'm gonna first start with the brand Mented. Mented Cosmetics is a black owned brand. That's what I've been really doing lately. I've been really investing my coin and money into black owned businesses because I mean, I want to support my people and a lot of stuff is really great, especially this company. So this was a um, lipstick trio. As you can see, one's missing because I've already used it. I haven't used these two, but I love the lipstick so far it is amazing so I decided to get their top three selling lipsticks it came in a little holiday set I think it was like maybe 35 bucks which is pretty good for three lipsticks so yeah so that's the first thing so I have my boxy charm for this month I have two of them because I finally got into the boxy premium which I'm super excited for cuz you guys are gonna see what's in that it's all Fenty um, but this is a base box, so let me show you guys how it looks like. So these are the products that I got in the BoxyCharm for this month. I got, ooh, I'm super excited about this. I love these. Okay, I got the Pharmacy Berry Cherry Clean Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. It looks like this. These bombs are pretty awesome. Like, these literally melt your makeup away. It makes it so easy to wash your face. I got a QMS Medi, Cos Medi Cosmetics Lip Line Corrector Lip Serum. I didn't know my lips needed serum, but I guess they do, so I'll try that out and see how it is. Um, okay. And then I got a Becca Lip Liner. I got this hair mask. Oh, that's perfect. Um, oh yeah, guys, this is my natural hair. I finally took it out um, of my braids like two days ago. So right now it's have it in a bun, but I got this Project Beauty Hair Girt Almond Honey Intense Repair Yogurt Mask. It looks like this. So I'm gonna try that out and see how it is. It's awesome. Perfect. And then the last thing I got is these palette by, I think this is by Hank and Hen Henry. It is. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this is this is pretty. Looks like this. These are the colors that come in the palette. So that's everything that I got in this month's boxy charm. That's some nice. That's some nice stuff. I got some pretty dope things. Now we're gonna move on to my Ipsy Glam bag. So a couple of these things are subscriptions as well, but I thought I could add them in here because why not? So this is March's Ipsy Glam bag. Oh, this is so cute. Look at this. This is such a cute bag, oh my gosh. But in my Ipsy Glam bag, I got a Tatcha water cream. Oh wow, the Tatcha water cream, now that's a little pricey. I got this highlighter by this brand called Shin China Bee, I think. Um, and then I also got a Pacifica Wild Hemp Hemp Infused Eyeshadow, looks like this. I don't wanna open these things. I'm not gonna open it unless I really want to because this video is gonna be way too long. I got another hair um, item. I guess they knew I was taking my hair out. Um, the Curl Friend Totally to Die for Defining Curl Cream by the brand Cake. Hmm, okay, cool. A little liquid eyeliner by this brand that I absolutely cannot pronounce. So yeah, that's everything that I got in my Ipsy 
glam bag. They gave me this big old box for this one little thing. I swear, you guys are gonna laugh. Give me like a little hand cream sam sample that looks like this. Um, but what I ordered is the Body Shop Vitamin E Intensive Hydration Night Cream. This is my absolute favorite cream or just anything to put on. Mostly at night because it's super duper thick. I love using this. This is like the only thing I use at night after I like, do my toner and all that stuff. I just put this on my face and that's it. Okay, now we're going to move on to the premium Boxy Charm box that is the next size up, which is the one I finally got accepted for. So this is what I'll be getting from now on instead of the little one. And the March Premium Box, they collabed with Fenty Beauty. So all the products in here at Fenty, which I'm so excited for. I got the Moroccan Spice Eyeshadow Palette, which I'm pretty sure you guys know how that looks like. They also gave us the freaking Trophy Wife Highlighter. Isn't that bomb? And I also got a Matchsticks, which I'm super excited. I've never tried her Matchsticks in the shade Rum. It's like a, ooh, yes. It looks like this. Oh, that's gonna be perfect. We also got the Invisimat Blotting Papers, which looks like this. I don't know if you guys can see that. They also gave us a Gloss Bomb in the shade Diamond Milk. That looks like this. I've used her gloss bombs before, just the regular one. I've never tried any other color. I got her matte, her matte Mazelle plush matte lipsticks. Looks like this in the shade Shade. Shade. Okay. Oh, I'm super excited about this. This is an Elf box. Okay. I ordered this a week and a half ago. It's a bunch of their new stuff. This is how it looks on the inside. Um, so I got a couple different items. So I got a couple of their new um, bite size eyeshadow things. They look like these, so I got a couple colors of those. And they're so travel friendly. Cause look how small they are. They're like literally so tiny. Also got their um, 16 hour camo concealer, but this is the new, did they give me? Oh, no, they didn't. Oh my. So I ordered the concealers, but I ordered the dewy ones, but they gave me the matte one. And I also got the Halo Glow Powder. That's everything that I got from e.l.f. So I will definitely be doing a full face of e.l.f. very, very soon. We're gonna move on to this box, which is a bunch of different things. So a while ago I ordered some stuff from Dose of Colors. I wanted to order another Francation palette because it's one of my favorite palettes. I use it a lot on my clients as well as myself and a couple shadows had shattered and broken from the one that I have so I ordered a backup one to have because yeah it was on sale and I needed it. I also picked this up actually at TJ Maxx. I was shopping with my um, friend and I found this it's my Ray Ray palette for seven bucks this palette isn't this beautiful I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this um, but I thought this was so pretty I love the pops of color I love the neutrals I think it would be really 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 fun to use um, this upcoming season uh, I also when I did my dose of colors order I also picked up the I love Sarai um, collection that she did with them it looks like that isn't that so cute these are the actual colors inside. Looks like this. Oh, I got a package! I also saw that they had these Stila shadows, the little liquid metal sh um, shadows that they have. Um, and these three colors that they have, guys, look at those. Oh my gosh, so, so pretty, and I cannot wait to use them. And the last thing that I picked up when I was at TJ Maxx was this Cover FX matte setting powder. They actually, they have some interesting, Yo, like when you go into Marshalls and TJ Maxx and stuff, don't don't even like, I I slept on all those places. Like I never thought you could find makeup because I don't go to those places for makeup, but they have a lot of stuff. Like if you go to the right ones, they have awesome stuff that is so, so cheap. This powder was $7 and on its own, this powder is probably 40 something bucks. I got a package. I got a package. I got a package. And the last two makeup things that I have are these two highlighters. 
I ordered a backup of the um, Desi and Katie Chasing the Sun highlighter. This is hands down my favorite highlighter of all time. And this is the Artist Couture Honey Drip Highlighter. First of all, look at this packaging. Isn't it so sleek? You see that gold? It's so, so, so pretty. And when you open it, it's like just magic. Now we can do skincare, which is what Asante just brought to me. First of all, I love, love, love Ula Henriksen boxes because they're so fun and cute. It always comes looking like this. I think they packed this wrong. Yo, they gave me like a whole extra product. I think that was my accent, but I ain't gonna say nothing. <laughs> These are the things that I got. Um, let me start off with what I really was on there for. So my favorite, one of my favorite things for them is their um, glow line, their orange line. So basically I got this. I've got this like three times. I will go through them so, so, so quickly. This is what I use every morning for my moisturizer. And before that, I use the serum. I actually have the full size one right now, but it's almost ending, you see? They get, and then the eye cream. Like this is like my go-to morning full step system and it works wonders and my skin loves me for it. This is what I got that I did not order, which I'm not complaining. Um, I got, <laughs> they gave me, I'm not gonna say I got, cause I didn't buy it. They gave me the Clean Truth Foaming Cleanser. I think my mom has this one too, and I have one at my house, a little one, and I actually really, really like it. So the fact that I have a full size one now, yo, this just made my day, like what? I actually really was supposed to get, and what I paid for, um, was this, the, Truth Juice Daily Cleanser. It looks like this. This is supposed to, it's a face cleanser that is supposed to break apart your makeup and really make it super duper easy to take that off. And like I said, I love their orange line. Their orange and blue line are my favorite. Um, so I wanted to get this and give that a shot and try it out. Last but not least, I ordered some sunglasses from Key Australia. Um, I got four pairs, one of them is in my car, I believe. Actually, I think it's in my bag. Let me let me go grab it. Hold on, give me a second. Okay, so these are my car sunglasses, is what I call them. You can wear them all the time. Look at them. Hold on. Ooh, ooh. Come on now. Give it to me. Serve. Work. And I also got these. These are the don't at me's. They look like this. Oh gosh. I hope I look okay with these. I'm gonna take care of these because these are my first like low-key kind of bougie sunglasses. Y'all, I'm telling you, I don't spend money on sunglasses, okay? Don't at me, okay? <laughs> and I also got these same ones, but in this turquoise, is it turquoise? Turquoise? Cheetah? I don't know what you wanna call it. The um, see-through ones, but they have that blue light that protects you from like when you're on your computer screen and stuff like that. I've worn these before, I wore them to my aunt's baby shower. These are super cute, I love these. These are super cute. Um, they're something very different, so that's why I got them. I thought, yo, this is an outfit right here, look at that. It goes with my shirt and everything. And the last pair is, I like aviators. When it comes to sunglasses, aviators are my favorite. No. But these are the gold on gold. So they look like this, gold on the side. These are so dope. And I thought these would be bomb for summertime. Look at these. I just wanna lay out by the pool. Yeah, so those are these glasses right here. And I also got this little case. It was on sale for like 10 bucks. It's a travel case for your sunglasses, but this holds two glasses. So you could put glasses in there and you could put glasses in there. So I thought this was such a smart idea. So if you're traveling and you want, you know, to keep your glasses safe, you can just keep them in here. Whew. I feel like this is gonna be a long video. I'm so sorry. If you made it to the end, I truly appreciate you and you don't know how much it means to me and it's people that, people like you that keep me going and that make me do this and that make me want to do this. But yes, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for showing your support. Thank you for being here. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know it's a little different, it's a lot of me talking. I'm 
pretty sure I'm gonna be doing a bunch of tutorials soon with all the things that I showed you guys so if there's anything you want to see in particular specifically please comment down below let me know please like this video and do not forget to subscribe and I will see you guys on the next one all right bye mm.